okay next lab related to static route as static route types previously we discussed static route types uh, one of them was directly attached static route second was recursive static route third was fully specified static route and the last one was uh, i believe the null something static null yes static null route so now we uh, discuss those theoretically let's do it so we're gonna use the same topology which we used previously for static route uh, this is the switch image and router image client svpcs and these are the ip address and we want to verify these things in the lab this is our target basic configuration is already done r1 is already configured r2 basic configuration is done r3 configuration is done pc1 server 1 and pc3 configuration is done and even the uh, default route is configured on r1 and also r2 is configured and even r3 is configured these are the basic stuff and the reachability is there from the previous lab so if i try to ping 1.1 and if i try to 1.2 so everything is done but we want to test type of configuration so the first one is directly attach static route configuration so directly attach means rather than to use the next hop we can use our exit interface let's go to show you so let me close this pc3 and this is r3 let's check out the routing table first what was the configuration so if i check out show uh, sorry show run and section ip route this was the command which i typed them for the network reachability let them come up here is i say that i want to go to this destination destination subnet mask is this one and this is the next hop and this next hop is basically r2 address this is my next hop this is my neighbor i will give everything to my neighbor but i don't want this one so what i can do i will type no and let me remove this one let me configure in another way another way is ip route by the way let me paste them the same command and let's remove this one up to this point only the changes are here so the first one is directly attach static route okay in this case my packet will not be reachable because i removed the route so you can see it will not ping if i try 1.2 so destination is unreachable and it's true because i removed the route i want to put them but this time i want to put them in another way i can put my exit interface what is my exit interface here 0 slash 2 so i will type g 0 slash 2 this type of route configuration is called directly attached static route and that's it and now pc1 pc3 will start work it was not working it's the same thing so this is the first way to configure static route and this type of static route is called directly attach when you use your exit interface you get the idea and let me remove this one let me come up and control a and type no so i remove again again pc3 will not uh, ping again destination unreachable now let's go to another second way to configure the static route which is called recursive static route recursive means rather than to use my exit interface i will type my neighbor ip and my neighbor ip sorry 23 23.2 sorry sorry i put no i need to remove the no command there is no so i say ip route going to this destination this subnet mask and the next hop where to send this packet is 23.2 and again the ping will start working and now you can see it's working so this type of configuration is called recursive static route let me remove again up arrow and come control a and type no again the ping will stop working you can see destination unreachable because no route is to reach there third way is fully specified static route fully specified static route means 
if I type here my exit interface as well which is g0 slash 2 this one and plus the next top 192 168 23.2 okay and enter and now the ping will start work again so this is the third way to configure static route and this type when you type your exit interface as well and next hop as well so we call them fully specified static route now coming to the last one a static null now for static null i need to do some changes let me remove the route again control a and type no and the ping will stop work again your destination unreachable what I need to do this time I need to type only the this one just this is enough don't need to type both and enter so it will start work again yeah so start working again yeah but what what do you think can I ping one dot uh, one as well yes can I ping one dot two as well yes Now what I need to do, I want to stop one of them, so I can direct them to the null. How? So this one is done, yeah, we done it the directly attached static route. Then we configure recursive static route. And then we configure fully specified static route to configure both options. And finally here the static null route so for null what I will do I will stop one of them 1.2 to the null they don't allow this one so right now from PC3 I can ping 1.2 and I can ping 1.1 if I don't want one of them suppose 1.1 I don't want so what I can do I will type IP route 192 168 1.1 255 255 255 255 four time okay let me continue this one so that it can stop so it's pinging yeah and here I will say null zero that whenever the traffic is coming from 192 168 1.1 drop them to null zero null zero is the virtual interface there to drop the packet silently and enter and now you will see it will stop working look at but the other will work 1.2 will work 1.2 is working and 1.1 i destroy them so this router cannot receive them and it will be in the routing table show show ip route static and here is they say that whenever 1.1 is coming it will be connected to null zero null zero is basically an interface to drop them we are not using in such scenario i just show you that how we can utilize this one normally in the summarize route we have extra route coming in summary so we can destroy them using this command static null but anyway here i show you that i don't need 1.1 yeah, I can ping 1.1, .1, sorry, 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, 1.5, all of them will work beside 1.1. .1. So this is called static null route. I hope so you get the idea. So this was lab related to uh, static route type configuration and we verify uh, them in the lab, okay? And let's move to another topic.